but I have a, a rush to the fourth, so I'll hit the blue up as near to the fourth hoop as I can. That's a rookie. And after the fourth, I've got to go over to the fifth, so I put the blue to the right of the hoop, so that after I've run through, I have a rush to the fifth hoop. And I have the rush, so I've got to rush this right, right over as near to the fifth as I can make it. That's quite good, a fraction too far. No, it's just right. Just to the side so that I can push blue down right behind the hoop so that after running the fifth, I can have a, a rush to the sixth. This needs a little stop shot because I'm rather close to the hoop in order to get the blue as far down as possible. And I've got to run through the hoop without going through too far to hit the blue. Just stopped right so that I can cut the blue down to the sixth hoop. This is a cut rush. Nearly got it to the hoop. Now it's rather to the side and after the sixth I have to turn to the left to get over to one back. So I want to leave blue on this left hand side of the hoop. So this is more of a takeoff approach pushing blue a little over to the left so that it's well behind the hoop. So we run the sixth hoop, trying to get a rush on blue to one back. Too far through, makes a very difficult one back hoop. Try and cut it over towards the hoop. A little nearer. Now, after making one back, I have to go right up to two back. And that means I want to get the blue behind the hoop at the same time as getting yellow in front of it. After making three wickets, you can see some of the difficulties that can be encountered when your break is limited to the use of only two balls.